In this video, I'm going to show you how you can animate your Wix button. So here is just some example animations of what can be done. We can make it bigger, we can get it moving on a loop, and there are many things that you can do with your button. So let's jump into it. So first, we need to add our button to our Wix website. So here I am inside of my Wix editor. For the video, we'll remove this one and we'll add a button together. So you need to go to the add elements in the top left hand corner and then you'll see text and then you'll see image and button. Click on button and you can add any button. This works for any button really. So you can also customize your button. So I'm just gonna add a basic black button and we're gonna go ahead and move it and we'll resize it just to make it visual and easy to understand. I'll then double click on the button and I'll change the text to example and click enter and that will update that. Now if I click on it and select it and go to design, we can also go to customize design and I can go to background and then what I can do is change the background color. So I'm gonna change it to red just to make it visual again. Now, the first thing that you can edit, if you go to customize design and go to hover, you can go ahead and edit that. So go ahead and leave that on hover and then click preview. And now it should animate when we hover over it. So go ahead and click on hover. And then what you can do, if you want a specific action to take place once you hover over it, you can change any of these. So if for example, when you hover over it, you wanna change it to black. If you're on hover, you can change whatever you want. And every time someone hovers over it, these changes will be made. Now this isn't how you animate it, this is just kind of a bonus way to do things. So if you change the hover settings when you hover over it, you can see it changes color in my instance. Now I'm gonna keep that, but I will also show you how to animate it. So if you click on your button, you then go to the animation icon. You've then got entrance animation and loop animation. So for the entrance animation, in the intro, what I did is I scrolled down and I added the expand animation. Now once you click on the animation you want, and click customize, you've got some motion styles, gentle, moderate, intense, I'm gonna click moderate here, and we're gonna keep the duration on two seconds, and I'll just give it like a 1.3 second delay, and if you click on this play button, it will give you a preview of what that looks like. What I also had going on in the intro was I went to loop, and I actually got this button to, it was either breathe, or I'm not too sure on the effect exactly, but you can choose any of these effects and if you're on the loop section, they are going to loop. So we'll leave it on breathe. And now what we can do, we can preview this. Now, three things are gonna happen once we hover over this. It's gonna change to black, it's gonna animate and it's gonna start looping our animations. So those are some ways that you can do it. I hope that video was helpful and did help you out.